The Queen Anne's County Department of Emergency Services has a new piece of technology that will help save lives, a video laryngoscope. So this is the AirTrack video laryngoscope that by the support of the county commissioners we were able to purchase with all the transport units and for all the supervisor units here within Queen Anne's County that will enhance our management of challenging airways in the field. Not all patients present themselves with clear airways where it's easy to put a breathing tube in place. This advanced medical device allows us to see the airway in video form while passing the critical breathing tube to assist a non-breathing patient. This gives us yet another confirmation and another tool in our toolbox to assist you or your loved one in the time of need when they're not breathing. So how many of these did we buy? So we bought 10 of them, which allows all of our ambulances and our, tr and our supervisor truck to have one. And they're fully stocked. And in fact, in our two reserve units, we have those as well. So, so these, fully stocked, ready to go. Excellent. So these are basically used, it's, it's basically a mini camera that we're using to insert into somebody's mouth to find a vocal cord so we can get uh, an airway into a patient. That's that that perfectly described. Mm -hmm. Sometimes when we encounter patients, they, they have very bloody airways or a lot of vomit in airways, mm -hmm. and the old way of intake Debating. We are very good at that, but this gives us a yet another confirmation to assure that we get that breathing tube in the first time to re reduce the, the time that it takes to get someone breathing again. And we had to train everybody on this? Everybody all, is qualified to use it? Yes, sir. All 65 of our providers, which wow. means the 45 full-time staff mm -hmm. and the 20 part-time staff, went through the training for this, this device and have successfully ready to use it. This is a device that is not a one-use device, is it? No, sir. Good. Once we pass the tube, mm -hmm. the tube stays obviously in the patient. Mm -hmm. The camera stays. This gets thrown away. This is never used again. Oh, so and this, this is never used again? This is never used again. This okay. is a breathing tube, mm -hmm. and either it's removed and the patient's good, or unfortunately it's removed and some patients expire. But you, know. you, you install them, you don't remove we them? We do not remove right. them. Right. That, Unless yeah. the patient suddenly wakes up, which we do have that because really? of our success. Wow. So We can replace two of them for less than $100. So it's a one time, but this is the camera that allows the vision to occur. And how long have we had them? We've had these in service now for four weeks. Really? And we've used them five times. Wow. As of today. Wow. Very good. Very good. And nobody's had any issues with them? Not so far. So is everybody happy that they'd rather have this than the old way? I think they love this. Yeah. And also, one of the other things is we had to get a little closer to the airways. Uh -huh. So sometimes some of those bodily fluids and all had oh. a way of eliminating out on our staff. This is, we get still down pretty close, but this will allow us not quite as close. Mm -hmm. so, so you insert that, how does it hook up? Is it, it you're, you're basically holding that, it's, it's in the side, oh, I see what you're saying. So we prep it before we insert it into uh -huh. the patient. Uh -huh. We find the airway and then we simply slide it into the airway mm -hmm. and it releases and we bring that out and that stays in. We secure that the it, airway and we put our breathing device, which is a bag valve mask on that. And does this stay in there? This comes out. Once, it's the, just, once the tube's is, in. This ah. is the guide to help us get into the trachea. Ah, okay, okay. Because everyone's, every trachea is a little different so we can put a little curve or straighten that depending on what we see with the anatomy. Wow, very good, awesome. Well, thank you. Appreciate that. I appreciate what you guys are doing. Very thankful that this is part of our uh, ammunition now to help save lives. Not a problem. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. It. Again, the video laryngoscopes were installed in all Queen Anne's County ambulances at the end of last year. To learn more about your Department of Emergency Services, visit qac.org and visit the DES page.